What is going on, everybody? And yes, we're going to be talking about the whole PewDiePie and Word situation that happened a couple of days ago. And I think the best way to describe the events of the past couple of days is that this is just one big shit show. And I had to make this video because this has been driving me crazy because I have been seeing people on both sides of the fence saying ridiculous things. I feel like I have to be the guy to come in from the middle and pretty much set the record straight from my view. So, if in case you don't know what's been going on, PewDiePie, a couple days ago on a stream of PlayerUnknown's Battlegrounds, he was trying to kill someone, got incredibly frustrated because he couldn't kill them, and he just casually said the N-word. And my issue here isn't just because he said the N-word, because I feel like you can say the N-word and have proper context. Like, you can say the word and then explain why the word is bad. Hopefully you get what I mean by that. There are ways to say the word and not be offensive. The issue I have here is that PewDiePie just casually said the word, and he said it in a way where it's like it would be a normal thing for him to say when he got frustrated. And people have actually defended him on this by saying, oh, well, he just got frustrated at a game and he said it. It's not a big deal. You know, I'm sorry. I've been frustrated at games all my goddamn life. I have broken controllers. I have broken other objects. I have said every curse word in the book. But I have never, ever, ever once said the N-word in frustration or any other racial slur for that matter. And people are also defending him by saying, oh, well... The N-word is just a word. That's all it is. It's just a word. No, it isn't just a word. It has meaning behind it. And it is greatly offensive to some people. It might not be offensive to you, but that doesn't mean it's not offensive to others. And there's other racial slurs like that. So no, it isn't just a word. I can't believe people have been using that as a defense. It's just amazing. And I think another big issue here is that PewDiePie has one of the biggest audiences on YouTube. And I I think a good portion of his audience is children. There's a lot of his audience that are little children or teenagers. And as a lot of us know, Little children and teenagers look up to older people and they try to imitate them. PewDiePie needs to be more responsible for what he says because of all these children that are watching him. They might watch his stream there and then think that it's okay to say the N-word when you're upset because PewDiePie did it. No, that's a really, really bad thing. That is not good, and there's going to be a lot of upset parents at PewDiePie and at who YouTube and other companies if that did happen. So PewDiePie needs to be more responsible for the words he uses when he makes videos. Now, let's get into the other side. I now want to talk about the people that are against PewDiePie in this situation. Now, don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I'm totally on your side when it comes to him saying the N-word. That is not good. That is a bad thing that he said it. I am totally on your side for that. But what I don't understand is how a lot of you can just generalize white people and say that, oh, PewDiePie doesn't think it's a bad word because, you know, he's white and he doesn't understand the meaning behind that word. And a lot of white people just don't understand racism. I am so sick and fucking tired of hearing that. Now, a lot of you know that I am white. And furthermore, I'm not just white. I'm a human fucking being. I'm tired of being told that I don't understand something when I fully understand racism. You want to know why I fully understand racism? Not just because 
it's you know it's common sense being racist is a bad thing but I have personally experienced racism and I know that's shocking right I'm white white people can't experience racism bullshit they can here's a little backstory when I was three years old my parents divorced and I would go visit my dad every other weekend at his home in Baltimore City. Yes, I grew up in Baltimore, which, by the way, in case you don't know this, Baltimore has a huge African-American population. And my dad lived in a neighborhood that was almost all African-American. And when I would go to visit him on those weekends, I would try to make friends with the fellow kids in the neighborhood, and nobody wanted to play with me. You want to know why nobody wanted to play with me? It's because I was different. It's because I was white. And their parents didn't want their children hanging out with somebody like me. So don't fucking tell me that I don't understand racism, because I have actually experienced it firsthand. And another thing that pisses me off is that there are a lot of African Americans that think it's okay for them to use the N-word, but nobody else can. I have never understood that. If the N-word is so offensive to you guys, and it should be because it is an offensive word, it was created to be derogatory towards you guys, why would you want to say the word yourselves? I have never understood that. I wish somebody please explain this to me. Why it's okay for African Americans to use the word, but not anyone else. I want that word to go away. I want all racial slurs to go away. I want people to see people as people. I'm tired of people judging other people based on skin color and gender. I'm so fucking sick of this. I want the N-word and all other racial slurs to go away. I don't want nobody to say them. So, I've been constantly seeing people defending that, you know, it's okay for us African Americans to use the word, but you guys can't. That is complete bullshit. If the word is so derogatory to, towards you guys, you would not want to say it either. I just don't understand that. So, that is about it. In conclusion, I just feel like there are people on all sides of this issue that really just don't get the big picture here. And it, it's just been driving me absolutely crazy. So, that is it. And that is all I'll be speaking on this topic. Because I contemplated not doing this video to begin with because I don't want to upset a lot of people, but I just had to speak my mind on this issue, so that is it. Please let me know what you think about this video and just the situation in general, and until next time, have a good one.